Hello, it's the You Never Know Matt Show. What up? All right, so I'm listening to this book called Daring Greatly by Brene Brown. And the book is basically about vulnerability. And vulnerability would be maybe putting ourselves in a position where our, uh, we're exposed emotionally and um, I guess you could call it being real and facing the uncertainty that comes with being real and being honest. And uh, long story short, someone just passed my car, it was weird. Uh, long story short, as far as vulnerability is concerned, is that, yeah, vulnerability is scary. Yeah, vulnerability uh, can make us feel like we're weakened for the moment. Uh, but ultimately, vulnerability also leads to like contentment and uh, the, the joy and um, all kinds of great things. So it's like, yeah, it is a bit scary, it's, but uh, if we're able to live vulnerably uh, and go through the uncertainty that it requires to, I'm a little on the slower side today, but guess what? The blog gets done either way. But I feel, I feel good about that. This is a little bit of an aside. I feel good about the fact that I'm making this and I don't feel like I have to be in a great mood or I have to be like, uh, like, hello there, salutations, brothers and sisters. Like, I'm kind of just here and I'm just me, you know, so like we're spending time together. Hi. Um, so vulnerability, yeah, it has to do with authenticity and it can be a bit scary, but it does lead to a uh, more full life. Uh, Brene Brown, Brene Brown, Brene Brown calls it uh, living wholeheartedly. Now, a little schmancy mancy, but this woman is like the supreme researcher and she knows her stuff. And uh, it turns out that in order to, in order to live the full life and be content, uh, we, we have to allow ourselves to be vulnerable. However you want to take that. Okay, so that's so you never know Matt show and uh, you have a good night, night. Have a good day, huh?